Well, Larry, this has really been a challenging week for CPD officers. Earlier in the week, two of them had been shot, and now this, a 36-year-old officer, he was off duty, is now dead likely the result of a carbon monoxide poisoning. Now, I just want to show you the outpouring of support from those police officers. It was a large police presence here at Swedish Covenant Hospital last night after the officer was transported here, and then later he passed on. Officers stood at attention, and they saluted as his remains was loaded into an ambulance. Now, more officers did line the procession route. Even an American flag was draped over the route by Chicago firefighters as that ambulance made its way to the medical examiner's office here in Cook County. Now, just minutes before 8 last night, that 36-year-old off-duty officer was discovered unresponsive along with a 29-year-old woman inside a home in the 3900 block of West Ainsley, which is in the city's Albany Park neighborhood. Now, both the officer and the woman were taken to Swedish Covenant in critical condition, but it was later revealed that that officer did die. People's Gas has told WGN that there was an extremely high level of carbon monoxide in that home. We are told it measured at 140 parts per million, which keep in mind anything over 100 is considered to be extremely dangerous. So that woman is still here fighting for her life. And we do know that Area North detectives are investigating to find out. They're calling this a uh, death investigation at this point. And we do also know that an autopsy will be performed on that officer later on. Reporting live from Swedish Covenant, Courtney Guzman, WGN News. Thank you, Courtney.